hello lovelies so in this video i'm going to share with you my latest moira uk haul so again i thought i would uh, share with you me opening the actual package um which obviously you can see me ripping into now like i'm dying to get my hands in this uh, so this one was uh, I ordered acrylic colours and I also ordered a uh, artistic gel which I haven't had a chance to try yet but look at this absolutely beautiful packaging it's pink it's sparkly it has love arts on I've got to say I think Moira UK do do the prettiest packaging that I have ever seen I mean look at that the attention to detail is stunning everything's well packaged I've never had a breakage so as you can see here is my new babies and then this is me beginning to swatch so the first collection that I decided to buy was the Harmony collection uh, these are gorgeous these are quite earthy tones um, and they've all got a like a some people say frost some people say shimmer I say they've got like a frost to them and um, they really really are lovely the first one that I'm swatching is a uh, yin yang um, as you can see, it, like I said, it, they're really earthy tones. Great for autumn and this time of year. Um, that's why I picked them. Uh, so as you can see, I'm just wiggling that around there so you can see the frost in it. Um, like I said, the whole collection has got a frost. They've all got a frost. So they do go really, really well together. So obviously if you want to use more than one colour in a set you'll be absolutely fine too and they blend well and also I think these would ombre beautifully while I was working with them I just kept thinking I want to ombre these um, this one is Peace it's a little bit darker than uh, Yin Yang but um, again it is lovely now this little beauty is called Melody and I think this one is my favourite out of the whole Harmony collection it's absolutely gorgeous i just oh just that on its own i think would be beautiful then this one and um, this i think this one stands out most in the collection because obviously it is the most different uh, as you can see this one's a green it's like a crisp green it's it's it is a really gorgeous color again it really stands out in the collection i think some people are scared of green as well but i think once you put it on your client and you finish your set they're always really pleasantly surprised so this last one is Blossom. Now this one is absolutely gorgeous as well. Oh, look at that colour. It is so deep. It's absolutely stunning. I think I could honestly swatch these all day. <laughs> Maybe this one could be my favourite. Oh, I don't know. I love them all. <laughs> But moving on to the next collection, this one is the Perfume Collection. Now this one that I'm swatching right now is called Scent. Um, the camera doesn't pick up the colour very well, which is a real shame because it is a stunning colour. Um, as you can see, it's a little bit harder to work with than the others, um, but that's because it's so highly pigmented. So um, it does take a little bit more getting used to, but once you've got it, the colour is, it is worth it, it's beautiful. Um, I think if I was obviously going to use this as my client, I would pick up with a little bead of clear as well, just to make it work um, that little bit easier. So I'm just trying to move this around now to try and get the best view that I can for you, because it's got like a pearlescent sheen to it. It doesn't pick up very well on the video at all, and because obviously the product is wet, um, but in the picture later you can see it a little bit better. So this next one is Perfection. And it literally is perfection. It's absolutely gorgeous. Yep, I love this one too. It's safe to say I'm going to tell you that I love them all because I do genuinely. I, I love them all. <laughs> there isn't one colour that sometimes you buy a, a lot and you get a colour and you're like, mm, no, I'm not really sure. No, I love every single one of these. This one seems to be a firm favourite. Uh, obviously I've showed these around a little bit and this one seems to be everybody's favourite. This one is Fragrance. And I love how they've all got their own little collection and they're all named something what's very apt for the collection. 
I love that. I really, I've got to admit, I do really love that. So this one is Fragrance. And then this next one, it's a really unusual colour. Um, it stood out straight away for me, I've got to admit, because, like, as you know, I, I do, I love my dark colours. This one's called Cologne. Um, I'm guessing from the name, I suppose it is the most masculine of the colours, if that makes sense. But it's beautiful, like, it's it's not black, it's not it's not grey, it's got, like, a, a pinky tone, like, frost in it. Oh, it's just delicious. And I think that matte would look beautiful. It really, really would. This next one is uh, rose water. This looks, this looks delicious. Like I get sometimes get an acrylic colour of a glitter, and I just think, oh my god, I want to smother myself in it. <laughs> this is one of those colours. Imagine this teamed up with a rose gold glitter. Oh my god. It's now. I think it's like half past ten at night, I think it is. And I am wanting to actually go and do a set of nails now that I've opened these. So these two are from the Jungle Collection. Um, I've only got two of these. The guys were nice enough to send me these two over to have a try. Uh, this one is Wild. Um, it's it's absolutely, it's a, it's a gorgeous colour. Obviously it is a brighter colour. So obviously it's great for summer, but... I do think if you dulled that down with a little bit of um, a chameleon kind of colour as well, or mustards, um, I think you could get away with that with autumn as well, definitely. And then this one is Orchid, which is a stunning, stunning, really soft baby pink, again, with a frosting. Um, one thing I will say about these powders is, I was pleasantly surprised, I, do, I have a hell of a lot of design powders. I mean, I have hundreds upon hundreds. And a lot of design powders that I've used tend to marble. Now, these guys, I've literally had no marbling, not one little bit of marbling. So, here, obviously, is my full haul for you to see. I really hope you liked it. Obviously, if you want me to keep doing things like this, just let me know. Um, and thank you for watching guys. I hope it was helpful. Happy shopping!